Time now for our Countdown to Sunday series, and we are exploring an age-old football tradition with fans of one of the game's first franchises. The Sunday tailgate is sacred to many. It's a place where you eat, drink, bond with friends, old and new. So we sent our Mark Strassman to Lambeau Field, the historic home of the Green Bay Packers. In Green Bay. This is what it's all about. The real kickoff to Packers home games. Go Pack Go! Happens outside the stadium. It seems like it's one big block party. It might be more than a block. <laughs> He's right. In Green Bay, the smallest NFL franchise by a long shot, tailgaters party in the parking lots. They party in houses directly across from historic Lambeau Field. They even party in and around an ambulance. It's like hosting like a dinner party in or out in every week. It's something it's like in a vehicle. April and Justin Batzler own the Lambulance. <laughs> an ambulance turned fanmobile. They bought it on Facebook six years ago from another pair of devoted cheeseheads. Since then, they've added two mini gators to their practice squad. It's been a crazy experience so far. It's like a big family reunion. Yep. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so fall is our neighborhood season because we see our friends and family every week here. For many of these fans, tailgating is as close as they'll get to seeing the field. The Packers have sold out season tickets every year since 1960. 1960. And the average time on the waiting list? 30 years. The Packers are the NFL's only publicly owned nonprofit. More than a half million die hard shareholders, team owners, and yet most of them can't get season tickets. It doesn't matter the outcome of the game, you've always had a good time. Paul and Zoe Belschner have the Packer fan trifecta shares in the team, season tickets, and a house that's a Lambeau leap across from Lambeau Field. So when you got the chance to own a house on Lombardi Avenue, across from the stadium, you said, yes, sir, I am. Opportunity, I am. yes, thank you. These Green Bay natives bought the house in 2016 as a tailgater's end zone. How do you explain what makes Packer tailgating special? It takes over the city. It defines who we are. Something else that makes tailgating here memorable. You can feel it. It's called Wisconsin Nice. People walking by, they're like, hey, can I buy a bra from you? It's like, go buy this half. The bra's yours. <laughs> you come and visit Green Bay and you don't feel like somebody took good care of you, something went wrong. A half hour before kickoff, the bachelors huddle for a shot ski. One long board, 30 shots of Wisconsin Nice. Sure, fans tailgate outside every NFL stadium, but nowhere like Green Bay, where anyone can join the pack of pre-gamers. It's like going to church. Friends, family, God, and the Green Bay Packers. <laughs> yeah. For CBS Mornings, Mark Strassman in Green Bay, Wisconsin. Is that how it goes? Friends, family, God, and the Green Bay Packers. <laughs> I will, that's one of my dreams is to visit tailgating uh, at a Packers game. At, you gotta go. Feel, yeah, and that, it was a shot ski. A shot ski, Nate. No doubt. Where brats are. <laughs> Listen, I remember going to Lambeau, driving that big old bus, because we're the opposing team, and it's just right in the middle of a residential neighborhood, and the fans were going crazy. It did look like a good time. Yeah. I'm not going to lie to you. Uh -huh. And shout out to the Green Bay Packers fans, some of the, the best fans in all of in sports, the... that's nice. for sure.